Joanna. Welcome back to number three of Joe's Web. Hey, so um, let me show you what I got at Hobby Lobby. That was on clearance. It's a crochet journal planner, a crochet planner. I'm so excited. Look, it's regular $39.99. $9.99. Can't beat that. Let me open it up. See what we got. So excited. <laughs> it's so cute. Look at the little crochet cat on the front of it like that. Oh, look, stickers. That's so cool. There's a little zipper pouch. I guess for your pens and markers and whatever. Oh, look at this, the chart of um, the stitches when you read charts, which I don't know how to do yet. So that is good for me. Works in progress. I think we all need about a hundred of these sheets, right? <laughs> okay, that is so cool. Go check out your Hobby Lobby and see if they have one there too. That is so neat. I love it. I love it. I love it. I picked this up because it was it was on sale for what? 40% off. Either 40 or 50% off. So it was only regular $11.99. So I thought that would be cute to put my little name on there, or whatever, put in my craft room. Check it out, y'all. Because I did not find any yarn marked clearance. Look at this hook. It's a size 15 millimeter, a Q for $249. That, this one was only $1.24. This is a four millimeter. I think I got one more like that. This one is a 6.5 millimeter. I actually did not buy all the sizes they had. They had some bigger ones and um, I don't use that much. I use mainly a four, five, and six. So that's why I got the four and the six and a half because of course they didn't have a five and a six. That's what a lot of people use, right? <laughs> They're gone. <laughs> one of my favorites with the bamboo handle. This one is really small. It is a 1.4 millimeter. Am I reading that right? Yep. Mm -hmm. And this one for $1.12 is a seven. It's a 1.5 millimeter. So I don't know if I'll ever use these either, but we'll see. <laughs> and they also, I got a couple of these um, stitch markers. Look, 67 cents. Can't beat that. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm not really one to buy um, luxury yarns, you know, at your local LYS, your local yarn shop. I do have one of those um, a couple of towns over from me. I've never been to it. Um, I really want to go check it out, so maybe I'll do that one day and film it and show y'all. That'll, that'll be fun. Yeah, so you know these um, luxury yarns cost so much money. They are so um, expensive. They're, you know, $20, $30, $40 a hank, maybe more, you know, so it's, it stretches the budget. But um, it is something that I want to lean towards as I'm, I'm progressing in my crochet career or whatever you want to call it. <laughs> you know, it's, it's, they're really nice and it's something I would love to to just have all these premium fibers one day. I am so excited about this. I know I'm very late to this game. I actually ordered Knit Crate. They had the big sale where you buy one, you sign up for the monthly thing, and they sent you a free subscription. 
So it was like two for the price of one. You paid extra $5 for shipping. So I, it got me. Hook, line, and sinker, it got me. And I know everybody's already opened theirs up yet, so I know probably what's in here, but I'm still gonna open it up on camera because it's exciting to me anyway, even though I know what I'm probably gonna be seeing. Just to see, just to see it for myself and feel it. Okay, here we go. Paper. <gasps> yep, it's the same one everybody got. Oh, it's gorgeous. It really is so pretty. <gasps> I love that little splash of yellow and the blue. What kind of merino? 75% merino wool, 15% silk, and 10% cashmere fingering weight. <gasps> love. <laughs> Yes, I got the same little bag that everyone else got too. Make something today, Nick Crate. That's really sweet. And the um, the booklet that comes with it with the with the patterns. Of course, we're not going to show that. But oh, that's so neat! I love it. I love it. You know, I saw, um, I can't wait. I'm, I th I'm probably going to keep this subscription because I really want to start getting more quality yarn. But, um, did you, did you see where they're doing like an entomology theme for April? Oh, I'm all about the bugs, people. I love bugs. That's why I'm Joe's web, um, because of the spider. But, um, yeah, my husband and I own a, a small pest control business, a local pest control business. So, you know, we're, you know, I'm all about insects and bugs and stuff, and I love them. Don't love the roaches. Mm -mm. <laughs> but I love beetles, and I love spiders, uh, and, of course, bees and butterflies. I love all that. Here's the next box. Wow. Wow. That is such a beautiful purple. Oh, Y'all, I gotta learn how to actually make something nice instead of all these little things that I do. I need to like make something really nice with this. This is 100% superwash merino. DK weight. I need to I need to study up on my terms. I'm thinking DK is a 2. Oh my goodness. That is gorgeous. I can't wait. Oh yeah, that's the card everyone else got too. <laughs> so funny. Sorry, it's just a card. <laughs> it's just a card again. <laughs> That's, so funny. That's hilarious. And here's the pattern book. I'm excited about this. I really am. I'm glad I decided to treat myself. I let my husband treat me. <laughs> Okay, let me see if I can show y'all a picture of the patterns in here. <gasps> this is what I want to make, but somebody's got to teach me how to knit. Oh my goodness. <gasps> I would love that. I watched Marley Bird um, video the other day. Was that about a week ago or something like that? Um, where she was teaching her mother how to knit. Her mother is hilarious. She is a hoot. I loved it. So I actually have these like big old thick knitting needles and I took out some um, blanket yarn and I knitted a little swatch about that big. <laughs> it looks horrible. But I tried and um, I think with um, a more stretchier yarn and a um, 
smaller needles. I could probably do it. I could probably figure it out. It's going to be a slow process, but I'll get there. This is gorgeous. Thanks, Knit Crate. So I don't know if I even showed y'all this bunny I made. I think I took a picture of it and posted it on Facebook. But it he had a um like a whiter, like an off-white face, and it just didn't look right. So I took off the white and added a black face. So he's really cute now. Really cute. And for my puppy dog, I added a little mouth. So that looks better with a little mouth on my puppy. So I'm gonna show y'all my Michaels haul. Michaels did have some yarn on clearance and I uh, of course bought too much. So let me show you what I, what I got. This is Endless Impeccable. It's, it's really soft, softer than I thought it would be because I'm not like a, a big Red Heart Super Saver kind of fan because it's scratchy and this is really soft. But look at this, for $9.97, um, how many, 1,790 yards. You can't beat it. I got two of them. Dink, dink. <laughs> Christmas gifts coming soon. <laughs> and I got one white. Now they had more. They had like six or seven whites. They had a couple more blacks, but I just, you gotta stop somewhere, right folks? <laughs> so Red Heart, um, oh, the Vanish Choice was only $1.97 marked down. I didn't pick up too many of those because um, I saw that the Red Heart Soft was on sale for $2.49 and <laughs> what was funny was they had some on clearance for two forty seven. I think that's what it was. But you know, it's like okay on clearance for two pennies less. <laughs> um, but I got a bunch. Let me show you the green. Got this berry color. Got some white, some black. Look at this beautiful. Color. Let's see what the name of this one is. Turquoise. Here's a, a Vanish Choice in a yellow. Got some uh, some off white or cream or what's off white? That's what it's called. Got some wheat. You always need those neutrals, you know, to add in or do stuff with. I don't know. I guess I'm partial to neutrals. Here's some gray. Let's see. It's called light gray heather. And this pretty green. Here's another Vanish Choice. And this one is aquamarine cinnabar. It's a real pretty orange. So, I got that many. They had the um, Snuggly Wuggly for $5, right? Was it $4.97 for these, a piece? Now these have 1,200 yards, 1,263 yards. This is a size three yarn. So I got the pink and the white in that. I got this Karen cake. I think I have one of these. I know I bought one before. I don't remember if I made anything with it. I'm trying to think. But if you look up Ashley on Heart Hook Home, she makes a one bag wonder. I think that's the name of her pattern that she made with this cake in these colors. It's a one bag wonder. I think that's the name of it. And it's gorgeous. And I did make one in a different color cake 
than what she used. And um, so I thought of her when I saw this because she loves that crusty mustard color, she calls it. She loves it. Y'all need to look her up. She's, she's really sweet, really cool. A lot of fun. Okay, and this was the thing I was excited about, was the Pantone, the Karen Pantone um, bamboo. So it was on sale for $5, and that's not bad. But I got this gorgeous color. It's like a peachy color. I really wanted to get more like a, a coral, you know, like a darker coral color, but I think I saw where that spot was empty, so someone beat me to it. It's gorgeous. I really love it. And I like now that the um, these are in a solid hank. When you get the solid color, it's one hank now. It's not five different hanks when you get a solid color. So, gotta spin that up. That'll be fun. So also at Michael's, they had the planners and all the planner accessories on sale for 40% off. So I'm trying again. I know if I start using a planner, it's gonna make my life much more simple and more organized. Um, but I always tend to buy one and then never use it, you know? So this is the planner I got. Choose joy. Isn't it pretty? I love rainbows. But I just love rainbows. And I love the choose joy. It just makes me happy. Makes my heart sing. So, I can't wait to dive into this. Now, another thing is this planner does not start until July. So, But guess what they had? It's called calendar extensions. It's undated calendar extension that you can just, apparently you can just stick this into your planner. Like pop it onto the rings. I don't know, I gotta figure out how all this works. Let me take a look at it. Oh, just let's just rip it open. Uh, undated month here, monthly spot, undated. So there's six extra months here. I wonder if I should bring it back. Maybe I'll just tape it. <laughs> I already ripped it open. <laughs> So I can put, put three months in the front and add the other three in the back and then I'll have like a, you know, two year planner <laughs> that hopefully I'm gonna use.
so, um, so, um, but, um, I just, um, uh, um, so, but, so, let me show you what I, what I got. Yeah, so you know these, um, um, oops, something on my screen. So, so, um, um, okay, okay, no, I'm not gay. <laughs> not that there's anything wrong with that, right? Remember that Seinfeld episode? <laughs> so, quiet on the set. <laughs> it's not working.